the 22nd of November 2015, Cloverdale, Indiana, it was 3.30 a.m. and I was driving home from my public safety position at DePauw University. I observed an orb in the western sky, it initially appeared to be a harvest moon setting in the west. It was not. What drew my total attention was the enormous size of the orb. It was immediately obvious it was not the moon. It appeared 50 to 100 times the size of the normal moon size. It was fiery orange in color and brilliant in contrast to the black sky with spotty cumulus clouds. View able from the glow of the orb as white fluffy clouds. It moved slightly north and south before dropping beyond the horizon in a due west direction. It initially appeared at about 30 degrees above the western horizon. I was shocked to see it disappear so quickly from sight considering the size and seemingly stagnate motion. I would estimate the distance from Earth to be fairly close as in possible flight levels around 35 to 40,000 feet. I cannot stress enough how big it was and how quickly it really moved while appearing to be motionless. I was in total awe. I drove from in 231 to 1000 s as fast as possible and drove west on 1000 s until it disappeared over the horizon, approximately 4, 5 miles a total viewing period of 5 to 7 minutes. Note, I have noticed several several instances of space junk re-entry prior to this viewing. They had shape and were blue, green and brilliant white light falling from north to south. Coincidence I don't know, no time to take pictures. The 27th of February 2016 12 a.m. Reelsville, Indiana outdoors to check a strange noise, unrelated to sighting. Looked to the northeast and saw, heard a prop plane flying west. Looking again to the northeast, along the path of the plane, I saw a steady white light moving rapidly to the south. When directly east of me, this object suddenly came to a full stop, reversed a short distance then stopped again. Just below the flight path of the first an identical object was also flying south. The second object vanished when directly below the first. The first object vanished a few seconds later. The 7th of May 2017, 10.35 p.m. Reelsville, Indiana outdoors to check a strange noise, unrelated to sighting. Looked to the northeast and saw, heard a prop plane flying west. Looking again to the northeast, along the path of the plane, I saw a steady white light moving rapidly to the south. When directly east of me, this object suddenly came to a full stop, reversed a short distance then stopped again. Just below the flight path of the first an identical object was also flying south. The second object vanished when directly below the first. The first object vanished a few seconds later. The 12th of September 2017, 12 a.m. Reelsville, Indiana I was outside looking south. There was a very bright white light, flashing about twice per second, no other colors, moving west to east below the cloud cover. It was larger and was going much faster than other aircraft. Fast enough that each flash looked to be a dash. Imagine Sirius on a clear night, flashing and rapidly moving. This object made a sudden 90-degree turn south. In about two seconds it made a similar turn to the east, then south again, then back east for three to four seconds then vanished. Possibly moving into and above the cloud layer. The cloud was not illuminated. I have seen others flying similar zigzag paths at high speed, but, never with this much cover or this size. Being a quiet rural area, jets and other aircraft are easily heard. This one was silent. The 11th of May 2013 12 a.m. Cloverdale, Indiana it was anywhere between 9 p.m. to 10 p.m. We were on a bus coming home from a band trip and then we were stuck in traffic. I was sitting on the bus talking to a friend when I noticed a grouping of lights over a field by the interstate. There was a spotlight coming out of the lights looked like it was searching for something. So I thought it was military or police helicopters due to the spotlight but a few seconds after this it started to fly towards our bus. At this point I get an uneasy feeling and know this is no group of helicopters but something else. 
I turn around and tell my other friend to look out the window and he yells to get everyone else to look by this time this thing is right over the interstate and shows its size and it was massive almost as wide as the interstate and was shaped like a diamond. It flew over us silently and it was clear the rain was not falling underneath it. It slowly flew east and eventually vanished into the clouds. This event happened in May 2013 I know I am late to report but my friends and others on the bus agreed to not report anything because a day or two later the military actually hang out around our town a few days and no one knew why. The event only happens a 5 to 10 miles from our town so we were scared they were here looking for witnesses. The 10th of September 2018 12 a.m. Reelsville, Indiana I noticed Venus, following the sunset, and Saturn, in the south-southwest, were very bright as I arrived home. As usual my neighbor's dog, a large but very friendly, female, pit bull mix, was there to greet me. After watching Venus for a moment, I saw, a few degrees off, what looked like a huge band of lights, white surrounded by red, began flashing and moving in my direction. As soon as the flashing began the dog seemed frightened, whining, repeatedly bumping my legs and jumping up to push on my chest. When the object was almost directly overhead the lights changed to all white and flashing sequentially from rear to front. At that point a soft gold color glow defined the edges, giving me the shape I have tried to illustrate. The object silently continued east until lost behind a stand of trees. As soon as the object was out of sight the dog made a short huffing sound, looked at me for a moment, then, seeing no reaction, calmly went home. I noticed something else. I have raccoons in my attic space. They are usually active from dusk till dawn. Right now, it is strangely quiet up there, an hour after the event. Reelsville, Indiana I was walking my dogs in the woods on Friday morning, December 7, when I heard sandhill cranes flying over. I hurried to a field where I could see better and tried to photograph the cranes on my Samsung S5 active phone. I did not notice anything unusual at the time. My dogs ran across the field and discovered a gutted deer, head intact. Upon reviewing the photos I saw a pinkish, purple orb with seven spots of light across its form that was high above the sun that I was shooting into, facing north. Within the same minute, I took another photo. In this one the orb had moved lower and to the right, east, of the sun and was surrounded by a large, bright aura that was banded, pale turquoise on the interior and red on the exterior. I had no idea what this was. The next morning, December 8, 9.50 am, I returned to the field and took sky pics. It was overcast but there is a light spot in the sky at approximately the same place as the orb the day before. I continued to photograph the sky throughout the week but didn't see anything in the pics. On December 16th at 10.22 a.m. with clear sky, there appears a yellow orb above and to the east of the sun, with about six tinier lights that are visible on December 18th at 9.50 a.m. with a clear sky, I took photos in approximately the same area. There was an interesting single cloud band. The first photo is not in focus, however the orb is slightly to the right, east, of the cloud band, is pale pinkish purple with nine or ten lights, the bottom five the brightest. It has an aura that has an elliptical shape and goes from a bright blue interior to red on the exterior edge. The orb isn't visible in the second photo. In the third photo taken a minute later, 9.51, the orb is further east of the cloud, clouds are moving west, appears flattened on the left side, is slightly transparent, cloud-like texture, and still has an aura. There are six bright lights, two on the lower right side, three across the middle, and one in the upper left. In the fourth photo, the lights are brighter, but only one is visible now on the bottom, middle row of lights appear the same, but top light has moved closer to the left edge. After viewing the first photos with the orb, I didn't know what to think. I did some internet searches and couldn't find anything definitive. I considered that what I saw in the pics could be a Samsung phone anomaly. However, I think the variety in the orb's color, the difference in the lights including position, size and brightness, in addition to the varied resolution of the images make me think it is something tangible. I wish I could see the orbs with my own eyes.